New Inquisition, fabled herald of the faith. Delivered from the grasp of the Fade by the hand of blessed Andraste herself. What could bring such an exalted creature here to the Imperial Court, I wonder? Do even you know? I'm here on important business concerning the entire Empire. As am I, it seems. I am Morrigan. Some call me advisor to Empress Selene on matters of the Arcane. You have been very busy this evening, hunting in every dark corner of the palace. Perhaps you and I hunt the same prey. I didn't realize I was watched so closely. All eyes are upon you, Inquisitor. Indeed, you distract from more important matters. Such as? Such as the unwelcome guest I recently found and killed within these very halls. An agent of Tevinter. So I offer you this, Inquisitor. A key found on the Tevinter's body. Where it leads, I cannot say. Yet, if Selene is in danger, I cannot leave her side long enough to search. You can. You left Selene alone. Is that wise? I must return to her anon, but she is safe enough for the moment. It would be a great fool who strikes at her in public in front of all her court and the Imperial Guard. What's your interest in protecting Empress Selene? Are you her bodyguard? <laughs> Do I seem a bodyguard to you? If anything were to happen to Selene, eyes would turn first to her occult advisor, even if they knew otherwise. There are sharks in the water, and I will not fall prey to them. Not now, not ever. Why did you kill the agent? You might have had useful information. I would not have slain the man on sight had he not attacked me first. Why? Undoubtedly, I caught him in an illicit act. I did not know from whence he came until after the battle and regret only that I could not capture him alive. What intentions the Imperium has here, I suspect you know far better than I. If you truly want answers, help me find them. I already told you, I must return to protect the Empress. Proceed with caution, Inquisitor. Enemies abound, and not all of them aligned with Tevinter. What comes next will be most exciting.